In order to make it easier for other team members to understand who they are working with, it's always handy to add in details to your profile. So we're going to do exactly that right here. So I'm already over here on my Slack interface that is in my Slack channel called TutorTube. And then I'm going to go around onto the top right corner where I can see a little face right here. So this is where I can access the edit profile option and I can edit the details right over there. So I'm just going to go to edit profile right here. And here the default name is TutorTube in small letters. So I'm just going to change it out to TutorTube just like this in capital and keep it together. So let's say this is my full name right here. Display name will be TutorTube as well. So I'm just going to say full name is going to be TutorTube channel while display name is going to be TutorTube. So in the what I do section, I want to uh, let people know about what you do. So I'm just going to go around and I'm going to type in I make video tutorials uh, video tutorials related to I make video tutorials related to multimedia and multimedia design and general computing so I'm just going to type this in right here I can also type in a phone number if I want to but I'm just going to leave it blank and then I can go around over here and choose a time zone as well. So I'm just going to go around and choose a time zone. Let's say, for example, Yangon. So let's say I'm from that area. So what I can do is simply choose this out. And then what I can do is I can upload an image. So I'm just going to click on upload an image and I can choose an image of my choice. So for this, I'm just going to select this out right over here and then upload my image out. So that is going to be like a profile picture for uh, the Slack so that it's easier to communicate with others and they immediately recognize me. So I'm just going to press save right here and then what happens is that my profile gets updated and then I'm going to click save changes right over here and you can see that my profile has changed. So I can simply click here and then what I can do is I can go to view profile and what happens is that now you can see that I can edit the profile, I can set the status, I can see more and others will be able to see your details as well if they click on it just like that. So now over here you can also add in titles like what I do I'm let's say for example uh, I'm a trainer just like this and I'm going to save changes and you can see that the trainer is there. I can set a status here over here as well. For example, working remotely or in a meeting and so forth. So especially if you're using this in an office environment, this is very helpful. And of course, you can go back to editing your profile and you have your more settings right here. So that is how you can work around and edit your profile inside of Slack. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.